Alavaka Alavaka Sutta Thus I have heard On one occasion the Blessed One was dwelling at Alavi in the abode of the Yaka Alavaka Then the Yaka Alavaka approached the Blessed One and said to him Get out, ascetic or oh, white friend the Blessed One said and he went out Come in, ascetic or oh, white friend the Blessed One said and he went in. A second time, a third time, the Yaka Alavka said to the Blessed One, Get out, Azatik, O oh, white friend, the Blessed One said, and he went out. Come in, Azatik, O oh, white friend, the Blessed One said, and he went in. A fourth time, the Yaka Alavka said to the Blessed One, Get out, Azatik, I won't go out, friend. Do whatever you must do. I'll ask you a question, Asati. If you won't answer me, I'll drive you insane or split your heart or grab you by the feet and hurl you across the Ganges. I don't see anyone in this world, friend, with its Devas, Mava and Brahma, in this population with its ascetic and Brahmins, its Devas and humans, who could drive me insane or split my heart or grab me by the feet and hold me across the Ganges. But ask whatever you want, friend. The Yaka Alavaka then address the Blessed One in verse. What here is a person's best treasure? What well practice brings happiness? What is really the sweetest of tastes? How lives on one whose life they say is best? The Blessed One. Faith is here a person's best treasure. The Dhamma well practiced brings happiness. Truth is really the sweetest of tastes. Living by wisdom, they say one's life is best. Alavka How does one cross the flood? How does one cross the sea? How does one overcome suffering? How is one fully purified? The Blessed One by faith, one crosses the flood. By heedfulness, one crosses the sea. By energy, one overcomes suffering. By wisdom, one is fully purified. Alavaka How does one gain wisdom? How does one find wealth? How does one achieve a claim? How does one bind friends? When passing from this world to the next, how does one not survive? The Blessed One Placing faith in the Dhamma of the Arahans for the attainment of Nibbana, one gains wisdom from a desire to learn if one is heedful and astute. Doing what is proper, dutiful, one with initiative finds wealth. By truthfulness, one wins acclaim by giving one binds friends. The faithful seeker of the household life who possesses these four qualities truth, dhamma, steadfastness, generosity does not sorrow when he passes on. Come now, ask the others as well, the many ascetics and brahmins, whether there exists here anything better than truth self-control, generosity, and patience. Alavaka Why now should I ask the many ascetics and brahmins? Today I have understood the good pertaining to future lives. Indeed, it was for my sake that the Buddha came to stay at Alavi. Today I have understood where what is given bears great fruit. Now I will travel about from village to village, from city to city, paying homage to the Enlightened One and to the excellence of the Dhamma.